You don't really like protein bars, do you? No, I don't eat protein bars. FYI, John doesn't eat protein bars or drink protein shakes. Isn't that right, man? That's true. I don't like the taste of it. It tastes like chemical in yeah. Keys to the there's... boot of my car, because there's a... Uh, I was going to say a present. It's not really a present, is it? There's a little something in the boot it's of my car. It's not really car. a surprise you're wearing one. Oh, yeah. <laughs> They're here. Yeah, that's a lot. Uh, check out the sexy motorbike there. Right, here we go. Here oh, it oh, is. Oh, oh, oh. They come in these, I'm quite impressed that they come in individual packets. Ziploc packets. Ziploc packets. So we could take the uh, clothes out and then start becoming drug dealers after. Loads of free baggies. Yeah. A fan. It's a fan. So anyway, this is what we Watch got. Is the channel. We got black teas like so. Can you look at the detailing? We've got our own little. S what is it? Spared no expense. Yeah. Embroidered by. It's good that, isn't it? It's good that. On the back. What's this one say? Feel the fibers. Yeah. So we got these ones. We have got some white teas as well. I'm gonna put a white tea on for you now. So they, we, when you actually look at them, I was like, mm, not sure on the ribbed collar. But as you can see, they actually look the nuts on. It makes for quite a nice, like, um, professional finish. So we always gonna whack. We want XL. I'll let you open the bag. It's quite a. Oh no. They're not. They're not very good bags. They're just broken. <laughs> they're high quality bags. Only the best. They're high quality bags. And then, well, Sam puts the white one, and we got these. We got the jumpers, and on the sleeve, we got that. You see that? Iron sharpens iron, baby. And then we left the back clean on that one. But on, we got the the SJTV stitched onto the to the uh, cuff or whatever you want to call it. Sleeve. Yeah, man. It's good, bro. What do we think? You like that? See the back? We've got the red logo on the back. It's good, isn't it? Wow. It fits really nice, is not it? Modeling. This could be the thumbnail. Huh? This could be the thumbnail. Bring it in. Favourite classic pose. <laughs> so how do they get one? No, so what we can do is you can either DM me, Sammy Boy, on Insta. We'll send you over the details. We'll send over a PayPal link on Insta. And then you can send give us our you. money. <laughs> when the money comes in. And then we'll send it out to you. Make sure, uh, make sure you put small. your address there though, so we can actually post it to you. Yeah, we're just, we're pretty small time in a minute, so we're just keeping it, small keeping time it low key on high quality. No, no website quite yet. It's not we're needed. progressing into that. New friends. New friends. That's one thing that's happened. We actually wanted these to turn up before the show. Yeah, we wanted them for show day. But it didn't happen. But they didn't happen. Let's reuse the old ones. How many days post show? It's the fourth day after the show. Four days, man. John's put a stone on already. I've put £12 on. £12 of cookies. £12 of cookies. I've had a bag of day. Actually, I had three bags the day after the show. And then I've had a bag a day since then. White chocolate and honeycomb. They're the best, isn't they? They are the best cookies ever. But no, all in all, it's good. Everybody's asking me how I feel. I'll be honest, I feel the same. The same. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not even lying to mm. you. I feel the same. I think it will hit when uh, when I do the first pro show. Yeah. You know, when I when I jump on a plane to America, 
and then I'll be like, ah, oh, shit. And now I'm going with the big boys, you know? Yeah. But for now, it's just back to everyday life. Back to the gym. I've had countless, 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 countless messages. Um, hundreds, literally hundreds of messages. People congratulating me, you know, wishing me good luck for the future, telling me that, you know, I've inspired them and like so many, so many cool messages. So that's been awesome. So I thank you guys for all of that. Yeah. Immediate plans. Immediate plans is get the fuck out the gym, man. <laughs> it's funny, I think you see a lot of people like, they're like back on the fucking train, they're doing the cardio the next day, and I'm like, fuck that, do no cardio, eat everything, do nothing. Yeah. Not training, just get away from the gym. I've got two injuries. One's my knee, which is getting a lot better now. Um, and the other one, which a lot of people don't actually know, they didn't realise because I didn't say it. If you watch the show day video, you can see this. Yeah, if you watch the show day, the first front double bicep I hit was so goddamn painful, it, it shocked me a little bit and I couldn't hold it. And then I, like, within the show, I had to be like, right, come on, you can't fucking lose this. But yeah. basically about, it was about four or five days before, I picked up a really bad injury and it's still really bad today. It's actually getting worse. I think I tore something around my intercostal or serratus or something like that and every shot like that side chest front double rear double because every pretty much every shot you have to lift your chest right and it fucking killed is like the sharpest pain and the bigger i lift my chest the more it hurts but i had to suck it up but yeah you'll see on the first front double i didn't hold it and that was why because the it was such a sh i thought the adrenaline would take over and it'll, but it didn't, it didn't. <laughs> You had me worried, mate. I was it like, didn't. Like, Hold it, John. So everyone was saying, like, oh, you had a great vacuum and everything like that. That was actually half a vac. I couldn't even get the vacuum in uh -huh. because the more I sucked in, the more it hurt. So I, I just had to do what I could on the day. But I never spoke about that leading up to the show because it, it, it didn't really matter, you know? Someone's been eating chocolate. Now it's about. Bitch. I'm worried about getting <laughs> it on me. Now it's about getting healthy. Well, now it's about eating. Then. After my holiday, I got holiday booked up, down to the Dominican, to the Caribbean. Ten days there, chill the fuck out, I come home. That. Then we're gonna both pick a show. Newsflash. It's my turn to step on the old <laughs> stage. John's actually, if you look, John started to uh, dial me in a little bit, which is why the face Get started to come in just Get, before the show, but I didn't want to mention bit of the it. Initial body. Because it is John's time, and I didn't want to take any shine off of what he worked so hard for. So I'm going to do my first show. I'm 34 years old now, so I think it's about time. Yeah. <laughs> show all that passion that you got for the sport. Exactly. Plus, it'll be good content for you guys to watch mm. as well. So it'll be it'll be a, a consistent. Also, camera girls going to be um, competing at the same time. Yeah. So you'll see her. You'll see me. I think we're going to have a really done. good year. Yeah, we are. Gonna I think it. we're all going to smash it. Because it's Sam's first show, so he's going to be... I remember my first show. I think he's going to be motivated to fuck to smash this show. Yeah. And and go for the win. And likewise, while, while I'm helping him prep for that show, I'm going to be prepping myself. I'll be slightly behind in my prep, but I think it's going to help me for my show as well because I'm not really going to be thinking about my prep. I'm just going to think about helping Sam. And then once your show's done... Then it'll be my show again, my no, so pro right. debut. That'd be good, because I'll be all fat and happy by the time you've dialed in. <laughs> yeah, that's what I mean. And then when when it, when the grind comes for me and I really need pushing, you'll be back to life. the energy <laughs> to do it. So that's how we're playing it. We're tactical. We haven't picked Iron sharpens yet. iron. That's it, that's where it comes from. Yeah. But, but yeah, we haven't, neither of us have picked a show yet. You're going to do two bros, you know that, don't you? I want to do two just bros for one reason only, one. and that was just because if I'm going to dip my toe into the pond, I want to do it against the best. So, and that's not slating any other federation, it's just a, it's just fact. It's just fact. If you want to if you want to be the best, you've got to beat the best. And that proved it as well. If you saw John's lineup, his class was stacked to fuck with amazing amazing talent. Mm. Yeah, fucking awesome. Yeah. We was backstage like, my God. <laughs> He's John, man. John was in the line. I didn't get a lot of footage backstage, but John was in the lineup and he was looking at me and he was like, they're all so stacked. <laughs> and I was... I didn't actually say that. I just looked at him like... No, he did. He did, did say I that. Did I say Yeah, you, were, you went, they're all so stacked. Oh, and remember. I just went, 
Don't worry about it, man. You're condi well more conditioned than all of them. But you can't see that when everyone's in a line, you know? And um, and he was like, yeah? And I was like, yeah. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, it just, it just showed it. When he went on stage, he was so much more conditioned than everyone else. Sometimes it's hard to look at it on the, on the screen and see it, but he was. He was harder, tighter, sharper. There was lines in him that I had never seen before. The day before the show, when you see me checking him out, it sounded a bit gay, but when you see me checking him out the night before, I'd never seen him be that good in my life. And I've been training yeah, for a long I'm, time. Yeah, even I knew what was on. Everything went pretty perfect, to be honest. Yeah. Everything went pretty good. The only slip up, like when I look back, Obviously, other than body parts I need to bring up, just looking at the overall day, the only thing I slipped up on really was that, that front double. That front double, I yeah. think I need to, going forward, practice holding my poses for even longer. All right, I did have an injury and it was hurting, but I could still practice holding them poses even longer and, um, and practice on my stage presentation even more, like in between poses and things like that. Yeah, you were relaxed times quite where a lot. I relaxed quite a lot. I did keep and I was shouting aware of that. Yeah. <laughs> Hold tight, John. Yeah. I think it's because you get a gist of some of the other guys relaxing and then you kind of follow suit, but you shouldn't. Nah, top three pick for the classic physique Olympia because it's three days away. Top three. Kion. Uh, not Kion, sorry. Oh. Bri Brion, sorry. I was like, it's changed. No, 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 no. I'll tell you why I said Kion is because somebody messaged me about 10 minutes ago asking me one, who's my current favourite classic pro and Kion, and I think is my favourite classic pro. I just yeah. really like his lines. Mine's Courage I, like I think who's going to win, I think Brion's going to win. Um, I think Christopher Bumstead's going to come second again, and I think uh, George Peterson is going to come third. That's such a boring top three, dude. But so, that's what I think. So obvious. But that's what I think is going to happen. So obvious, but that's what I think is going to happen. Yeah, no. Nah. I actually, going on what I saw today on Instagram, which is hard because you can never tell, but George Peterson looks on. Um, Christopher Bumstead looks good. But I'm going to go, I'm actually going to be controversial and say George Peterson for the win. I don't think they can choose George Peterson. He's an old motherfucker. He can still win it. Dex was old motherfucker and he beat Jay. I yeah. think it's going to be George Peterson <laughs> going to win it. I think Keown second. And I think Breon third. Wow, you're just saying this. You don't think it. I do. No, you Keown, don't. Keown is a dark horse. You think Keown's going to beat Breon? They like him a lot. And the, the IFBB are trying to push Keown. Mark my words. They like that guy a lot. You can just tell. You can tell when there's hype behind someone and Keown's got so much hype going into this. I think it's going to be Kieran is definitely going to make that top three, 100%. Personally, though, I prefer Courage O'Para's physique. When that guy dials in, if he dials in, that guy, I think, could take the whole thing. But that's it, that's conditioning for you. On that note, let's get this shit. Yeah. Peace. <laughs> you should, we should do a video of you with just all of your medals around your neck, like all of them. <laughs> holding your Weighed sword, down. <laughs> holding your sword and your dagger with your profile in your teeth, like. <laughs> you so can that. wash both of your hats now. Oh yeah, I can wash my hats. Yeah. John was not going to wash any of his hats until, until he turned that. pro. But so now I turned pro. That's pretty disgusting, but fun fact. <laughs>